Hey, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna compare and contrast the two major types of recruiting, agency and in-house. The internet and especially social media sites like LinkedIn have made it easier and cheaper than ever for managers to hire talent directly. But this process is usually slow and inefficient and results in uninformed hiring decisions. There are risks involved with this. Obviously, inexperienced employees can harm the efficiency of the workflow of a company, but there's also a big monetary cost involved as well. Firing and rehiring an employee costs about twice of their total employment costs, a significant amount. This is why companies rely on either agency or in-house recruiters to greatly reduce, if not completely remove, the risk of hiring the wrong candidates. Their expertise in the staffing sphere and knowledge of the industry can help make the process quick and painless. While both in-house and agency recruiters utilize the much of the same skill set and ultimately have similar goals, there are some pretty significant differences between them. So I thought who better to go into detail about this topic than myself, an established professional recruiter. But before we get started, as always, please consider like, subscribe, click that bell, really, really means a lot. So are you an aspiring recruiter wondering what career direction is best for you? Or maybe you have a business or organization that's quickly growing and has roles to fill. In either case though, there are two general options to choose from when it comes to recruitment, in-house and agency. While their general responsibilities remain the same in both roles, agency and in-house recruiters source talent from a variety of places in order to develop a talent pipeline. They utilize the same tools to do their jobs, including administration programs, job boards, and applicant tracking systems. That being said though, there are some differences that should be highlighted between the two types of recruiting to help better understand them and make an informed decision on which is the best option for you. In-house recruiting. In-house recruiters are just like any other salaried employees of a company. They fulfill needs internally, working on developing Helping executing long-term hiring strategies. They work closely or inside the organization's HR or people department in order to create a pipeline of talent. Agency recruiting. On the other hand, there are recruitment agencies, third parties that are hired by other companies to source and hire new talent. Recruitment agencies have multiple clients and usually work across several industries. They often hired as as needed typically for short-term or specific specialized projects. Similarities. Since in-house recruiters and recruitment agencies are both in the business of sourcing and hiring qualified candidates, there are some basic similarities between both roles. In either case though, recruiters have to form a strong relationship with the company who is hiring in order to best understand their needs. They also need to research the relevant industries and develop lists of potentially qualified candidates to reach out to and interview. Both in-house and agency recruiters have to get to know their candidates so that they can help find the perfect role for them. Both will utilize some of the processes like gathering content candidates, using a job boards and even an applicant tracking system, and will work closely with hiring managers to determine the most qualified for the job. Differences. Despite having the same processes and goals, there are some pretty big differences between in-house and agencies. There are benefits and drawbacks to both. While recruiting agencies certainly have a knowledge of the relevant industries they work in, in-house recruiters are typically experts in their field and also have the benefit of being familiar with the company's work culture and environment as they work directly in the company. They can easily communicate internally with other teams within organizations to hone in on what they're really looking for in a candidate. In-house recruiters are strongly team workers. Since they are permanent, salaried employees, they work long-term with companies to improve and implement their hiring strategies for maximum retention. They are involved in all aspects of the hiring process including onboarding and training. In addition, in-house recruiting is typically more administrative and focused also on recurring daily duties. They are focused on developing and maintaining a long-term retention plan, hiring for integral roles that require special knowledge of their industry and company culture. On the other hand, recruitment agencies rely on constant work from multitude of clients. In order to build up their client base, the role becomes very sales-oriented. Recruitment agencies are constantly reaching out to potential leads and trying to convince them that they have the solution to their staffing issues. Agency recruiting is more fast-paced and results driven, and your success drives further business. Agency recruiters have the difficult task of selling services to both the client and the candidates, which can be especially challenging. However, a seasoned agency recruiter has already built a wide network of potential sources, which is where the value comes in. The main benefit of working with a recruitment agency is getting quality results fast. They're typically well-versed in a particular industry or niche, so they can quickly pick out the qualified candidates from their pool without having to do too much research on what the hiring manager is looking for. Additionally, since they're working with other clients, they will be able to quickly fill positions from their wide list of contacts in order to move on to the next client. 
Working with a recruitment agency is generally less expensive than hiring a dedicated recruiter long term. Recruitment agencies are paid via commission, usually a percentage of the candidate's salary once they are successfully placed. A big benefit to working with an agency is you can hire them temporarily as needed. You won't need to pay for them if you don't have any roles that need filling. As such, they provide a huge return on investment in both the speed and quality of candidates. A salaried in-house recruiter will also require benefits and resources, while an agency can be hired as needed, saving time and valuable money. That being said though, there are times when an in-house recruiter is more appropriate for a business depending on their goals. Which is better? So at some point, companies have to decide whether to outsource the recruitment efforts to an agency or to hire an in-house talent to source and hire new employees. Honestly, in my opinion, there is no better option. It depends on the size and goals of the company and both offer the same general services. Which option a business decides to go with is ultimately up to them. Agencies work with a high volume of clients, typically across multiple industries, and often for short-term or temporary roles. They are more concerned with finding someone with specific qualifications to get a specialized job done over things like cultural fit. They are best suited for specialized or high volume recruitment, but can also be helpful in finding more generalized employees as well. Companies who invest in a recruitment agency will leave most if not all of the jobs to them so efforts can be focused elsewhere. In-house recruiters work exclusively for the company they are hired for and often have a better understanding of internal communications and even company culture. As such, they work closely with the rest of the organizations, the hiring managers to fill long-term roles across the entire company. In-house recruiters are better for large companies with constant needs to fill open positions or ones looking for a long-term talent pipeline. So for those looking to get into recruiting, both roles have their benefits. If you're more proactive and more sales-oriented, a fast-paced agency job is for you. If you're looking for more stability and commitment, Commitment, consider looking for an in-house role. So do you have any more thoughts about in-house recruiting versus staffing agencies? Please be sure to drop a comment below. I love hearing from you guys. If you like this video and want to see more like it, just a friendly reminder, please consider liking, subscribing, clicking that bell. It really means a lot. Feel free to also follow me at Preston underscore Park as I try my best to also post daily. Thanks again and we'll see you on the next one.